Hi YouTube, basically I was browsing the web earlier and I saw some people were asking how to transfer reco recordings from your Humax box onto a USB pen drive or pen stick. Uh, so basically I thought I'd just make a quick video just showing how quick easy it is to do really. Uh, first, um, worth mentioning is if it's HD content uh, such as like there you go, that's HD and that ENC there, it basically means it's encoded, which pretty much all HD stuff on here is. Uh, and if you try to play it back on a computer, it basically just all chops up and is a mess. Uh, I read that whatever box you recorded it on, that's basically the only thing we'll be able to play it back if it's HD. But with standard F it works fine. Um, and all you need is your pen drive in the FAT32 format. Um, I'm using the Foxat HDR box, which has two USB ports, one on the front, one on the back, and it doesn't matter which you use. Um, if your pen drive is the correct format, once you plug it in, you should get a little box pop up, just to say it's ready to use. There you go. Um, once you've got that, you just want to press media to bring up all your recordings. and. Then you want to press Opt Plus, which is that button there. Just press that and then go to File Manager. Uh, if this is the first time you're using it, you might have hard disk drive on both that side and that side. Um, if so, you just press right and then Opt Plus again and make sure you pick your pen drive. Once you do that, you have to press OK on SDA, otherwise it basically won't let you copy anything. So press OK on that and you'll get dot dot dot, which is what you want. Uh, then go back to the left and you'll have all your stuff on your hard drive. Uh, then it's literally just highlight whatever you want and press green to copy it. There you go, and it's copying. Uh, basically the video is in .ts format, which isn't great but it does play in VLC uh, just obviously standard def uh, content but um, if you want to convert it and you want it in MPEG or something like that I can recommend a pretty good app which I've been using um, I did use Handbrake originally but it messed up the sound quite a bit um, so then I started using this other one which I'd quickly show in case any of you want to convert once you've done anything. Oops. Right, yeah, it's called FFmpeg X or FFmpeg 10, whichever approach they're going for. But yeah, it's really simple. I'm using PowerPC, so I can't. There's probably stuff a lot better for Intel based. But, um,. Yeah, basically you just choose your source and then choose your target and it's got quite a few formats it hasn't got MKV though I don't think there you go. that's the list of formats it comes with so if some of you did want to convert that's quite a good way of doing it anyway um, I hope this video is of use and I hope it helps some of you out thanks for watching